friends today i discuss suspension what is suspension suspension is a first thing heterogeneous mixture hetero genius mixture so suspension is heterogeneous mixture and heterogeneous mixture in which in which the solute particles in which the solute particles do not dissolve do not dissolve but remain suspended but remain suspended remain suspended throughout the bulk of medium throughout the bulk of medium throughout the bulk of medium particles of suspension particle of a suspension are visible to naked eye so i can also say visible to particles of particles of suspension particles of suspension are visible to naked eye visible to naked eye visible to naked eye and particle of suspension scatter a beam of light passing through it and make its path visible so the next property of suspension is particle of suspension particle of suspension scatter a scatter a beam of light scatter a beam of light passing through it passing through it so path visible path visible next property of suspension is the solute particle settle down when a suspension is left undisturbed means suspension means solute particles solute particles settle down settle down when a suspension when a suspension is left undisturbed undisturbed that is that is suspension a uh, suspension that is suspension is unstable suspension is unstable and they can be they cannot be separated from the mixture by filtration by filtration so now i take one example of suspension this is the these all are the properties of suspension now i take a example of suspension so the example of solution example of suspension solution is sand in water sand in water if sand in if i mix sand in water and i left for some time then sand then sand unsettled down then sand unsettled down or sand particle settled down when a suspension is left undisturbed so this is called a unstable solution unstable mixture or unstable solution 
Now discuss one more type of solution in next page. Now discuss colloidal solution. Now discuss colloidal solution. So the first property of colloidal solution, colloidal solution is heterogeneous mixture. Heterogeneous mixture. Next, size of particle is too small. Size of particle is too small. Too small, not visible by, not individually seen by naked eyes. Now the third property is, colloids are, colloids are big enough big enough to scatter a to scatter a beam of light to scatter a beam of light passing through it passing through it passing through it and path may visible path visible path is visible and this type of and this effect of or we can say the scattering of a beam of light in colloidal solution is called Tyndall effect it's called Tyndall effect and the name and the Tyndall effect after the name of the scientist who discovered this effect who discovered this effect. Now the fourth property is not settle down not settle down when left undisturbed when left undisturbed and also cannot separated by cannot separated by cannot separated by process of filtration process of filtration process of filtration but a special type of process is used means centrifugation centrifugation can be used can be used to separate can be used to separate the colloidal particles the colloidal particles the example of colloidal solution age the example of colloidal solution age solution age fog mist saving cream and jelly so these are most these are more to more example of colloidal solution now the component of solution is of two types component of solution is two types so the colloidal solution has two component first is dispersed phase and second is dispersion medium dispersion medium dispersion medium the solute like component or the dispersed particles or the dispersed particle in a colloidal form the dispersed phase so basically dispersed phase is basically dispersed phase in dispersed particle in dispersed 
पार्टिकल इन कोलोइडल फॉर्म कोलोइडल फॉर्म एंड डिस्पर्स मीडियम एज द कंपोनेंट इन वर्ड इन विच द कंपोनेंट इन विच कंपोनेंट इन विच द डिस्पर्स फेस इज सस्पेंडेड इन विच डिस्पर्स फेस is suspended is suspended it's called dispersion medium it's called dispersion medium if i talk about fog if i take a example of fog then in fog dispersed phase is liquid and dispersing medium is gas in case of shaving cream dispersed phase is gas and dispersing medium is liquid and in case of jelly dispersed phase in liquid is liquid and dispersion medium is solid so i hope you understand what is colloidal solution and what is suspension so please download the score learning app and if you already download this then enjoy learning thanks to watching this video